Speaking in Port Moresby, the Medan governor says the open MP continues to be absent from a number of provincial assembly meetings. Yama says this is one reason he has questioned the citizenship of Krima. Governor Yama says people of Medan must know the truth. To testify, to tell the court the truth, nothing but the truth, whether Brian Krema is true, the son of the Krema family. So it is in the best interest of this country, and we don't want it to happen again next time. And we don't want any foreign element or foreign people in this country to become leaders in the name of false pretense. In other matters, the Medan governor echoes his disappointment over the influx of outside police personnel being deployed to Medan by the open MP. Yama says these selected police officers continue to assault and cause fear not to just the public and community but public servants as well. He has condemned the actions by the outside police officers. Now those policemen must know that you are not above the law. The human rights under the law will come after you. I have now asked the family of those people to come and lay complaints and I will assist them and support them and pay the legal fees for them and we have to come against those policemen. And they are not above the law. The Medan governor concluded his conference by appealing to the police minister and police commissioner to intervene and address the current airwalk and rampage by policemen in Medang. He says something must be done as people are living in fear. Yama also warned those rogue officers. Minister, you must put your foot down. The police ministry, ministry should come under your control now. And tell the police commissioner to come down and has to deal with him. And what he's doing is totally wrong and not listen to the minister for justice. All my people are making this roadblock everywhere here and there. And they're suppressing the rights of my people. My public servants are very fear now of their own lives. Because of the so people, so-called policemen, come in the name of rule of law. Jack Lepave, Jr., National MTV News.